Welcome to my TMI tag. This is for everybody that just wants to know a little bit more about who they're subscribing to. Well, obviously, I want to know who I'm subscribing to. I actually enjoy like knowing about these things. So, jumping right into it. Question number one: What are you wearing? Psh, I wish I knew. I thought today was a good Canadian tuxedo day, so I'm wearing this cute thingy I got out of my mom's closet. She actually wore this when she was like 19, and these jeans, and this Forever 21 crop top. It's so cute in the back, it crisscrosses. <clears throat> so yeah. Ever been in love? Yeah. Ever had a terrible breakup? Honestly, I don't think my breakup was ever terrible. Um, on their end, they say it's terrible, but I think it was just a normal breakup. Like, it was a 10th grade relationship that I just didn't take seriously. I was like 14, so. How tall are you? I am somewhere between 4'11 and 5 feet. <laughs> How much do you weigh? Sometimes I'm 113, sometimes I'm 110. I don't know. Any tattoos? I can't really commit to a permanent doodle on my body, so no. Any piercings? I have two in this ear and one in this ear. I'm letting the other one on this ear close because it's been destroyed. Like, I got it pierced like twice and it just, it's always in the wrong spot, so I'm just over it. On the phone, I guess. I'm texting a lot of people right now. Well, not right now, but anyways. <laughs> Favorite show, I don't really have one. I watch the Kardashians a lot, but that's just cause like that's the only thing that's ever on when I'm awake. <clears throat> um, and I like their style, so sometimes I get some like style tips from them, so I'm not completely hating. Favorite band. I don't have a favorite band. Um <laughs> uh, I guess if I had to pick a favorite band, it would probably be Maroon 5, honestly. I forgot that was a band. <laughs> Um, something you miss. I miss all the money I spent um, on fast food my first semester of college. It was at least a thousand bucks, like I swear. Um, favorite song? Uh, right now, it's probably any like R&B love song that I can sing because I like singing. So, how old are you? I'm 18. Zodiac sign Virgo. Uh, quality look for in a partner trust worthiness and loyalty and uh, uniqueness and I don't want you to be like so consumed with all this social media stuff like if you're worried about Instagram likes more than you are like your future occupation school that stuff like I don't want to do with you those kind of people get on my nerves favorite quote um, it's something my mom always says when I'm freaking out about just random stuff in life she'll just be like Sid how do you eat an elephant? Bit by bit, which just means like no matter how big or small the task is, take your time and eventually it'll get done. Like it's some kind of philosophy. She studies a bunch of philosophy, so she transfers that knowledge to me. Thankfully. Favorite actor. Oh gosh, I have so many. Oh, I guess right now I'd have to say my favorite actor would be me. <laughs> I was an extra in a movie recently. <laughs> um, favorite color, black or pink or sparkles. I don't know. Clear. Loud music or soft? If it's in my headphones, I want it to be loud. If it's in the car, I want it to be loud. If it's out loud and I'm in my room or something, soft. Favorite song. Okay, well, do you guys know Beja Rodriguez? She was an OMG girl that recently, like, started her own thing. I like her song, Lipstick. It was one of her first singles she dropped. Um, and this one really ratchet song <laughs> from Love and Hip Hop by Mariah Lynn, Once Upon a Time. That song does not describe my life at all whatsoever, but it's so catchy. I love it. Oh, and Be My Baby by Ariana Grande. I love it. Oh, and um, Sierra. Um, Let's dance like we're making love. Uh, 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 make it love. Uh. I love that song. Ah. And, oh, by the way, I'm 
bunch of old stuff. I love old music. And so yeah, those are my favorite songs. Where do you go when you're sad? Mm, anywhere I could be alone. <laughs> How long does it take you to shower? About 45 minutes and longer if I need to shave or wash my hair. <laughs> Um, how long does it take you to get ready in the morning? About, uh, like if I have to leave at 7, I'll get up at 5.30, so do the math. Because I don't feel like it. Um, <laughs> even, oh, ever been in a physical fight? Almost. I was in the 6th grade. I wasn't in it because I'm such a peaceful person, but I was about to be in one because people mistake my kindness for weakness. But, um, I lay one paw on them. And it was over. I didn't have to fight him. Um, turn on intellect. Turn off is stupidity, ignorance. Dumbest. <laughs> the reason I joined YouTube. Originally I joined YouTube in like the seventh grade. My name was Mindless Candy 2. And I don't know if I was recording the whole time. My camera just turned off. Am I not focused? Oh my god, it's so annoying. Focus on my face. I'll just scooch up like this, I guess. This is so annoying. Anyways, I said I joined YouTube because I enjoyed making the videos, and I do, but like stuff like this is getting on my nerves. I can never get the camera to act right. Ugh. Fears. The devil. <laughs> like, I'm not even joking. That's my fear. I'm a child of God last thing that made you cry obviously I'm not trying to talk about it <laughs> just life situations my own ignorance how about that last time I said I love someone was probably like last night when I got off the phone with my boyfriend um, or this morning, actually, whenever my mom left for work, I said I loved her. Meaning behind your YouTube name. My first name for my YouTube name was actually um, one of my pet's names, and she means a lot to me. Um, and she's gone now. And I just like the name Bella. And Nicole is actually a name that is also very beautiful. It is my middle name, so. That was so lame. Um, last book you read. I honestly don't know because I don't like, I like reading, but nothing interests me really except for like nonfiction. So, and I haven't really just had someone interest me to where I wanted to read their novel or something. So, I mean their autobiography or their philosophy or something, so. Um, yeah, I don't know. A book you are currently reading, none. Last show you watched, it was Looney Tunes. <clears throat> I'm not even lying to you, I've just watched Looney Tunes. Last person you talked to, my friend Lexi. We're supposed to be going to Buffalo Wild Wings in a little bit. Uh, last, oh, the relationship between you and the person you last texted. She's my friend, acquaintance, associate, friend. So yeah, friend, acquaintance, associate friend. <laughs> Favorite food? I eat everything, bro, except for like nasty stuff like liver and celery and tomatoes. So I have no idea. Place I want to visit, I want to visit Victoria Falls. I think it's in like Zambia, Africa or something like that. It's in Africa. Ugh, my freaking watch keeps shining everywhere. Do you have a crush? Yeah, on my boyfriend. <laughs> Last place you were? Downstairs in my house. Last time you kissed someone? I don't even know because last time I kissed someone, I guess my mom last night when I said goodnight because yeah, I don't just be kissing all over everybody. Um, last time you were insulted? Um, probably very recently behind my back to be honest but to my face or like t 
texted to me or something not recently I don't remember ever being insulted really what instruments do you play I play I want to play piano because it's so beautiful but I just haven't had the time to take lessons and I want to play guitar but I've tried to take lessons but my hands are so small I just it's so hard <laughs> favorite piece of jewelry is this ring underneath this fake zigzag one and this Michael Kors watch oh and my pearl necklace I love pearl necklaces my mom bought it for me for probably like Valentine's Day or my birthday or something and it's so beautiful I love it so much favorite flavor of sweet I'd have to say me hello just kidding I don't really like sweets to be honest like cake and pie and stuff I'll turn it down so quick I don't eat it plus my dentist says um <laughs> I need to floss more and yada yada so I avoid sweets now because I'm always getting bad <laughs> results at the dentist last sport I played on a team the last sport I played was um well I participated in track and field <laughs> worst ever but my favorite sport I've ever played was powder puff football um, and soccer is really fun too. <sighs> the last song you sang, honestly, I cannot remember. It's it was by Mariah Carey, but I don't know the name. Favorite chat up line. I've never used a pickup line in my life, so I don't use chat up lines. Guys come to girls. I don't have to go to them. They come to me. Uh. Anyways, I really want to think of one like really slick. Oh shoot. Let me let y'all in on a little secret. When I was single, I was not afraid to go talk to somebody. I just didn't use pickup lines. But one thing I did do to like creep on guys, like if I saw a really cute guy and like he just walked past me in the mall or something, I have no idea who he is or any of his friends. I just like keep stalking him. Like I'll walk behind him and I'll just keep saying like slick remarks and walk past him and do all kind of creepy stuff until he asks me what I'm doing and I'm just like oh nothing I'm just walking through the mall like one time across the mall like across the food court this guy was just so cute and I was like oh my gosh I have to talk to him so I put myself out there and I was like hey baby and I just kept saying hey baby like really loud it's so lame but it was so funny or I'll go to the guy and just be like do you know where this and that is? Can you show me where it is? And while he's like showing me there, I'll just be like talking to him, telling him all my talents, you know, planting the seeds in his head until he decides, wow, she's a good catch. She can cook, she can run track, kind of, and she can <laughs> dance, and she's pretty. You just gotta plant all the little good seeds about yourself subliminally until he, it clicks in his mind. It might take a little while because some guys just don't be thinking, but it always worked I've never not gotten somebody that I liked so I try to burp I can never burp and I did a little beat on my face today just a little bit you know and I'm scared to let somebody in on this no new friends no no no